Hello YouTubers, this is Downer, back to you with a new update on the Xbox PUBG patch. This is patch number 9, went li live today. And there's a few good features. I'm going to jump right in and tell you what they are. As you can see, this is, the, this is one feature that was not in the patch notes. It is a jet ski and it is hilarious <laughs> and I didn't expect this to be in here yet it is on the PC but man this is this is a fun rig a lot better views than boat you can only fit two people but that's okay uh, and I'll read out the patch notes for you guys and uh, let you know what you think so first off Introduced multiple pre-match starting locations in order to optimize both server and game client performance. Weapons are now removed from the starting island prior to the st match starting. Uh, game DVR is now supported for automatic recording of gameplay highlights. This feature must be enabled with the options setting menu. We continue to listen to your feedback and have lowered the damage taken from objects throughout the world such as rocks, trees and uneven terrain. Adjust the design effects of both water and red zone bombing. Party matchmaking is now influenced by the player's MMR. Adjusted long range blood V effects back to the original colors. Uh, improved visibility of squad member colors, yellow, orange, blue and green. Players can use the right thumbstick to rotate their character during model customization. When customizing character appearance, the D-pad can be held to switch between menus. Preview is supported when customizing appearance or creating a new character. For the items, the energy drink is now updated. Design is a bit of difficult. Uh, bug fixes. Fixed water sound effects. Fixed red zone disappearing immediately after it starts. Fixed random character teleportation following initial landing. Fixed an issue where some doors could not be entered despite appearing open. Fixed an issue of recovery and boost items being able to be used when underwater. Uh, fixed uh, character animations when transitioning from jump prone to standing. Fixed unexpected char character death caused by falling while moving. Fixed areas of fencing where specific sides could not be penetrated by bullets. Fixed bullet buildings with missing stairs. Fixed bug which caused objects to float in the air. Fixed areas of terrain which were causing players characters to become stuck. Fixed an issue of revive being cancelled unintentionally. Fixed hand animations when reloading shooting the car 98 in a prone position. Fix the issue limiting peak parachuting speed in FPP mode. Fixed character animations when moved from prone to entering the vehicle. Optimization and um, optimized textures, landscapes, and buildings throughout the island to improve performance. Fix the crash occurring when HDR was enabled. Fix the character character frozen character issue when reconnecting following a crash. A crash. Fix the crash occurring when the player opened their inventory. And fix the crash occurring when the spectated player was using the scope. Uh, localization, there's a couple new things. Applied new Russian, Japanese, and Chinese simplified traditional fonts. Japanese only adjusted the katakana font. Japanese, Japanese only fixed and correct order of wording during object interactions. Portuguese only fixed the display of height meter when parachuting. A couple known issues with this patch is the B button incorrectly displayed to cut cut parachute cable. This should be X. And when viewing a map, the X, Y, and B functions are fully functional. So please be aware. That when exiting a plane or vehicle in motion that you can jump out while using the map so watch out don't press b and that's it folks uh, i had a few games of it and 
the stability is definitely improved. I find the game a bit more smooth. A uh, couple good, couple good updates here. But there's a few new glitches, so you know you expect it to be, uh, you know, good comes with the bad. You know what I mean? But there is one glitch now that apparently that you can start to revive somebody and cancel it and they will still revive so that's <laughs> you, it's good and bad I guess it ruins the game but it's good if you're in a peak situation and whatever but so that's it uh, tell me what you think um, please like and subscribe and could you hit that little bell icon so you receive a notification every time that I upload a video thanks guys till next time